Remember to subscribe to our channel. And if you like our content, please give us a thumbs up. <laughs> and thank you to all of our new subscribers. <laughs>
whenever I need to clear my mind or to open my mind to new thinking and new ideas. That day, the sun was shining and the forest was in full bloom. Oh, how I love to see all of the rich, wonderful greens and other colors of nature around me. I also love the fresh smell of spring in the forest. As I looked around, I could see wonderful colors from the flowers of different shapes and sizes. And on this particular day, I also noticed the green clovers that had sprung up. Yes, I continued to look and I noticed that I could see many clovers around me. Wouldn't it be great if today I could find a four-leaf clover? It has been said that many believe that the four-leaf clovers are lucky. And I always am open to a little luck. Oh, you don't say, my laddie. Now those are some lucky little fellas. Ho, ho. I thought if I could find a four-leaf clover, I'm sure it would bring me not only luck, but maybe even more wonderful ideas to draw. That day, I did find many things in the forest. I also found many three-leaf clovers, but no four-leaf clovers. I thought to myself that this was a great day, but perhaps this wasn't going to be my lucky day. But I did enjoy the walk. It was such a nice day. The sun was shining, the birds were chirping, a soft breeze was blowing, and the forest was filled with many greens and beautiful colors. As I continued to walk in the forest, the weather began to change. The sky became grayer and the wind began to blow. And before long, it started to rain. Oh boy! Just moments ago, the weather was so wonderful, I thought. And now, just like that, it has begun to rain. Perhaps today is not my lucky day. However, it's not raining too hard, and it actually feels kind of nice. Just then, the rain turned into a soft mist. The clouds began to open, and the sun began to shine through. And then, it happened. A wonderful rainbow appeared before me in the forest. Oh, wow! How beautiful the colors, I thought. From red to orange to yellow to green to blue to violet. <laughs> I looked on with happy amazement. As the beams touched the ground, they began to flicker and sparkle in golden color. And then it transformed into what looked like a golden coin. I continued to look at this little creature, but I couldn't quite make out what this creature actually was. I even tried to catch the little creature to get a closer look. But before I could, the little creature had flown away. At that point, I wondered if I'd ever see the little golden creature again. Little did I know that the golden creature had found its way further into the woods all the way to Bun's house. I, I wonder what that sound is. Hmm. Hmm. That day, Buns must have heard the little humming coming from this little creature. He went outside to look around. But no matter how hard he looked, Buns could not find the little golden creature. Hmm, I thought for sure I heard something out here. Hmm, oh well.
Meanwhile, I continued to look for the little golden creature. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, well. I guess, just like luck, you never know when it's going to turn up. <laughs> and so, after searching for some time, I decided I would look just a little bit longer before heading back to the Creativity Castle. And just then, as I looked down towards the ground, something shiny <laughs> caught my eye. Oh, could it be? And the little bright shiny gold coin sprung from the ground and danced in the air before me. <laughs> and just for a moment, the little golden creature landed on my paw. <laughs> Here you are, little gold bug. <laughs> In fact, now I can tell that this wasn't really a gold bug, but rather a special magical gold coin. <laughs> Just then, I had my aha moment. This little creature would be my new inspiration. <laughs> I would decide to call this little creature golden because of its shiny golden color. So Golden also became known as my lucky gold bug. <laughs> golden, I thought, would be the inspiration for my next drawing. <laughs> as I continued my walk, this little golden creature continued to stay with me, buzzing about, dancing around as I enjoyed my walk in the forest. Today was a good day. In fact, today was my lucky day. <laughs> so Golden would follow me home to the Creativity Castle that day, being a creative, free, and independent creature, Golden would come and go as Golden would like to. But for me, Golden would always show up at those special times, especially when I was looking for that little extra spark of inspiration. And that is how I found Golden. <laughs> oh, what an interesting story that was, Sourpuss. So I take it that Golden little creature was the inspiration for a drawing of yours. <laughs> That's right. That Golden little creature is what we'll draw on our next show. Till then. From all of us at Sourpuss and Friends, Happy St. Patrick's Day! Happy St. Patrick's Day! We'll see you next time, and remember to... Be creative! I love to be creative I love to draw and play When I play and draw with sour puss and friends Ho ho! Remember to go to our website for our latest activities and downloads. Register today for free! Ho ho! Join us next time at Sour